Hello everybody. I'm in the C4D here. And I have a scene here I've done a little bit more too. I looked into how big New Jerusalem is. And there it is. I basically just took uh, some of the squares in the center and raised them up to the same length and breadth that the foundation is, according to Revelation. And I thought I'd find out how big it was. And, uh, and the length is as large as the breadth. And he measured the city with the reed, which I assume is the whole city. Because if this thing's four times as big as that, it's huge, huge, huge. It's already huge. 12,000 furlongs, which i come out to be 1,500 miles. The length and breadth and the height of it are equal. So the height is as equal as the length and, and the breadth. So that would actually be taller, maybe, but... Or no, it would be equal. So it would be the height, the length, breadth, and height. The height would be equal to each. So it would be 1,500 miles in, right? That's 1,500 miles. And if you want to see what it looks like with the earth spinning, there you go. <laughs> yeah, take off to the great white north, wasn't that? Um, who was those guys? Uh, oh, I can't think of them now. Take off, eh? The comedians. Um, let me put the. Uh, see the foundation let's put it on the sphere and see what happens wow first of all a city that big would not be able to set on a globe it's too big as you can see so you know there's some people out there who owe me an apology then that's all I'll say <laughs> 